Riley Rover is the beginner's entry point for competing in the rescue line competition of RoboCup Junior. Basically your robot needs to start following a black line that you can see in the video until it gets all the way to the green chemical spill area where it's got to find the can and push it out. That's a successful rescue if your robot can do that. You can only do Riley Rover in your first year of participating in the rescue line competition. After that you need to do either primary, secondary or open. Your robot will need to be able to navigate around corners and curves, go over a bridge, speed bumps, a seesaw and around a water tower. It doesn't need to know how to turn on green. It doesn't need to know how to do the gridlock. And once the rescue has been completed, it doesn't need to get back out again. It can just stop. Well, your robot needs two light sensors so that it can follow the line wherever it goes. One sensor is on either side of the line. Two motors and at least three wheels. And a sonic sensor so it can detect objects like the water tower and find the rescue can. It's up to you to work out how to put all of that together so that your robot works and then all that's left is the coding.